All right. Hi guys, uh, I would like to for you to start practicing piano again the same way that we did in class. So I'm gonna just remind you the first exercise that we did together from C, no, the five notes exercise from G and from the other notes, just reminding you. So I want you to look at my hand to make sure that you remember how to do it the right way. First, I'm gonna start with the right hand. Uh, make sure all the fingers are on the keys. Make sure you sit, sit up straight and you uh, don't touch the back of the piano. Make sure that you have a shoulder in this place, not bringing it up and your elbows away from your body and it, uh, it helps you to hold the hand and all the fingers. The fingers are curved. Important thing is to have all the fingers uh, not at the edge of the piano like that, but closer and curved. So I'm going to start with the C note. As you remember, the C key is right before the group of three black, two black keys. And you are going to play just five notes, one at a time, using the all the fingers. Now, if you're done with this, you can do it with eight notes. You're going to do it a couple of times, then you repeat the same exercise with your left hand. The left hand, make sure your fifth finger stays on C note and it goes up to the first finger on the G note. And it's the same requirements. Make sure the elbow stays, hold the key, uh, the fingers, the hand. Make sure uh, your wrist is lower than the knuckles, but it's not touching the piano. And all the fingers are curved and make sure the fingers are not on the edge of the keys, but in the middle. So now you're doing the same exercise from the C note with the left hand. All the fingers going up and down, working hard for you. Make sure the hand is not tensed. Then you're gonna do the exercise together with both hands. Now you're gonna do the eight notes if you're ready. If you're done with the C key, I want you to repeat it from G key. the eight notes you make sure to, to group them by four notes like that one one then you go to D note and you have the F sharp the third finger is on F sharp this is F and you raise it the half tone up then you do it from A with the C sharp and I want you if you're ready to add one more from F it's a little bit different now from F you're gonna play two key white keys and you play the black key B flat so all together if you're ready you can do the same exercise from C G D A and F five notes where the D and A exercise are with the sharp note in the middle and the F exercise with the B flat, the fourth key.